Hi, this is Sid Rock, and I'm explaining to you today about fractals from my book, A Simple Explanation of Absolutely Everything. And we're going to talk about fractals using an ordinary stalk of broccoli. So I want you to see what broccoli looks like. You know, it has these florets on the top, and it also has these leaves at the bottom, right? So you see the leaves leading up to this layer of florette. So we could say that's the basic pattern or formula of this broccoli. One thing about broccoli is it's a fractal. So each layer of the broccoli looks just like the layer above it. It's a nested fractal. Let's see how many layers we can go down. And by the time we dissect this broccoli, you'll understand what a, fra a fractal is. First, let's observe that it all starts with this layer of leaves. So that was our first clue about heading into this one layer, right? So I'm going to just take any of these stalks, any of the stalks. Here, let's take this guy. So I'm breaking off one of the stalks. Now see, look. It, particularly if I move it away, huh? It looks just like its mom there. It even has the little layers of leaves. Only it's little lead-in leaves or small. Okay, I'm putting away the mom layer. We all know what broccoli looks like. Now we're looking at layer two. This was layer one of this mama fractal, or the first iteration. This is the second iteration of the broccoli. It has the same little pattern starting off of the leaves before you get to the florets, right? So it looks just like the other one. It even has the same pattern or formula of florets coming up above the layer of leaves. So, okay, let me, I guess I'll use the knife. So I'm just kind of breaking off one wedge of this broccoli. Okay, so now I've got the next iteration. We're at the third level of broccoli. And by the way, if I bring it back here, you see the baby looks just like the mama because they're fractals. They express the same shape. I am going to make a hypothesis now that there is going to be a little baby layer of leaves kicking off this next next level. I've never really paid attention to the leaves before. Let's see. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, there's the little leaves. Okay, so it's got its own little layer of leaves. That was a hypothesis that was just proven by noticing what the fractal formula was for broccoli. And above that little layer of leaves, then what? We've got uh, all these little florets still, right? So we're already at the third iteration from the mama. Now we're going to peel off just any of these layers inside of this broccoli to the next layer down. And here it is. Uh, you see, it still looks just like the original, although they're getting sloppier with my ability to dissect them. So what are we now? The fourth iteration of the formula for this particular fractal, which is called broccoli. Now, what do we see when we get down close? And there's probably a layer of leaves. They might be so small that we don't see them because this is such a uh, immature part of this broccoli. But I can notice one thing. I'm trying to hold it up right. See, even at this fourth iteration level, there's a fifth iteration level where its little buds look just like florets, right? They look like broccoli florets. I can barely see it. Let's peel off one of them. Okay, so now we've got the sixth, was it now the sixth iteration of the broccoli formula? I should expect tiny little leaves under the florets, but I frankly, I can't see that well anymore. So uh, we're just going to have to take our word for it. Maybe if you put this sixth iteration under a microscope, we'd see if there was a seventh iteration of florets. Hmm. All right. That's what a fractal is. It's layers of a nested shape or formula or algorithm 
that proceed along the same lines as the levels above and below it. It's the same thing, see? Even though it's just that much smaller. Plus this one proceeds from that one. This is an iteration of this. And that's fractals.